We've got Kansas City, can they three peak? They gotta get past the Saints. Hunch time, you nailed. Uh, David Montgomery touched on, by the way, I see you. Hamilton, get in here and do your thing. Oh, yes, I disagree is. with you on the, uh, on the Sean McDermott stuff. I'll let you go first, Luke, sorry <laughs> about that. Um, <laughs> Uh, Travis Kelsey's not scored a touchdown yet this year. What's your hunch? Does he get one tonight against the Saints? Absolutely. I think he's, I think, I think Monday night football, Travis Kelsey gets his first one. And I'm curious to see what he does when he does in fact score a touchdown tonight. Does he dance? Does he give it back to the official? Does he run to the sideline? I think he's been waiting <laughs> these first couple weeks for a touchdown. So I'm curious to see what he does. Easy. I love that. Kat, I believe Kat, anything turn. Luke says, I'm like, that's happening. <laughs> like, done. Write it in the book. It's happening. Okay, go ahead. I got to make it easy. 100%. Um, all right. Chris Olave's receiving line is set at 59 and a half yards for tonight. What's your hunch? Over or under there? Way over. I'm going to go Ooh. way over. I would go over if this was. 59 and a half? I would go over if this was 80. If this was 80, I'd take the. Wow. Don't, don't raise your eyebrows at me. Three straight go. games. Three straight games, he has 80 plus, okay? Chiefs' pass defense has given up yardage this year. 22nd pass yards allowed. Saints are going to open it up under the bright lights, I think. I'm going, oh, I, even with Spags, I know you're a big Spags fan. Yeah, but I, 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 I think he hits 100 tonight. I'm going to double down. Okay, double him down. <laughs> 100 yards it. for love. You're taking the under on 59 and a half yards? I'm a defensive guy. He's got an extra day to get ready. I'm Dude. going spags, locking down Chris Olave. What do you got, Ham? Next one. Wow. All right, Luke, next one. The Chiefs, five and a half point favorites tonight. What's your hunch? Who gets the win here? I'm going, I think the Chiefs, I think the Chiefs are going to win. I don't think, I don't think they're going to cover though. I think that that Saints defense is really daggone good. And I think they hold them. I think they limit them. But I think Travis Kelsey scores in the end zone. They win, but they don't cover. It's a weird week. I'm going to go Saints. Weird week. My my 10-year-old nephew wants to be Commissioner Roger Goodell one day. He said the Saints are upsetting. I'm saying, let's make the AFC even weirder. Let's give the, the Bengals a better chance. So I think they lose tonight. Go ahead, Em. <laughs> All right, Kat. You know we got to do it. Oh, first gosh. first touchdown score. Let's go. Bring up the full screen. Who's punching in the first touchdown tonight? Oh, man. Luke loves Spags. I love Andy. Defense versus offense here. I'm going to say uh, Andy's going to draw a red zone play. <laughs> um, let's see. I don't know. Oh, eeny, meeny, miny, Alvin Kamara. That's the easiest one, right? Low-hanging fruit. Uh, and yeah. I'm going to say it's a receiving touchdown. If you can go even further down a, a, a well here on FanDuel Sportsbook. Clint Kubiak's going to put him out wide, dial something, and get him the ball out in space. What do you think, Luke? I'm going, I'm going Travis Kelsey first score on a little Andy Reid shovel pass. <laughs> Near the goal line. This is not fair. <laughs> Hamilton, this is, a, this is a BS segment. I cannot go up against Luke Keekly and calling out what's going to happen in any said game. This is ridiculous. Um, Ham, who do you got in this one? I'm, I'm with you. I, have a, I just have a feeling the Saints, the Saints bring it tonight and, and pull this one Love off. Love that. Uh, with the Chiefs dealing with those injuries, I think, I think they get it done. 